And finally, I can confirm that on January 4 at approximately 12 p.m. Iraq time, U.S. forces took necessary and proportionate action against Mushtaq Jawad Kazim al-Jawari, a.k.a. Abu Taqwa, who is a Harakat al-Najuba leader. Abu Taqwa was actively involved in planning and carrying out attacks against American personnel. The strike also killed another Han member. It is important to note that the strike was taken in self-defense, that no civilians were harmed, and that no infrastructure or facilities were struck. <laughs> Again, I'm not going to have any more details to provide as it relates uh, to this this particular strike uh, and, uh, you know, in, in terms of the specific attacks uh, that that Han has conducted against U.S. forces in, in Iraq and Syria. As you well know, you've been following this for a while. Uh, those attacks have continued, putting U.S. forces in danger. Uh, and as I just highlighted to, uh, to Jennifer, we maintain the inherent right of self-defense and will continue to take necessary actions to protect our personnel. Um, so as far as your other question, um, you know, Iraq is an important and valued partner. Uh, our forces are there at the invitation of the government of Iraq to help train and advise in support of the defeat ISIS mission. And so as we have been doing all along, we will continue to consult closely with the Iraqi government about the safety and security of U.S. forces. Uh, in the meantime, we will continue to stay very focused on that Defeat ISIS mission.